Well, I have entered the Dead Man's Challenge code. And here we go. Well, they're not going to be talking to me either way. So, it doesn't really matter. And I won't take any feats. And we'll see what happens. Now that there's birch bar tea, that gives a little bit of an edge to survive here. I mean, without it, it's just suicide run. <laughs> a little bit of a slow suicide run, but suicide run nonetheless. So I am in Timberwolf Mountain, Pleasant Valley. This looks like the little Timberwolf Mountain area start. Hmm. Beginning of the day, freezing to death. Well, one really nice thing about this, uh, this spot is I know where the matches are. But I really don't want to die to try to get to them. Let's go around. Of course, it does look like it's going to be a daytime blizzard happening. From the looks of it. Am I sure I know where I'm going? Hmm. Maybe. Uh, headwind. Since the objective is to lose as little condition as possible, I think running would be in order here. Of course, everything is at very high, so it's all going to be a drastic condition loss. So let's get this going. No tinder. As per usual. Could add a piece of tinder there. Stick. Actions. Tinder plug. Let's lose some condition while making tinder. Sixty, forty-five, sixty. Yeah, I'm good with that. I'm gonna lose a piece of tinder. Let's do it over something useful. You could be nice to me. I guess I could have started with fire with fire starting level three, but the whole purpose of this is to make it really difficult. So might as well make it really difficult. So how far off am I? 14 degrees. Wow. I don't know if I can overcome the cold with this. I just don't know. Okay. Good. <laughs> yeah, that's a good place to stop. Alright, let's throw all the wood in there. How about that? It's daytime. Right. Survive the outdoors. Okay. It's 
in good shape. So what do we got? Three hours. Let's get warmed up. And make some water. Absolutely. A tiny bit. Okay. Yeah, it's going to get there, isn't it? There we go. I mean, the full experience. I'm sure I will have a need for these. So let's pick them up. Okay, okay, I'm back by the fire. Let's make more water. I'm gonna negotiate this blizzard. I'm in no hurry. Are you in a hurry? I'm in no hurry. Hmm. I'd go run out and grab some sticks, but I will lose all this warmth quickly. Oh, I just dropped down. Um, excuse me? Don't get colder on me. Be nice if I had some cloth. Which I don't have. Not bad. Hmm. I don't like bunch of nothing. Could I read myself out of a blizzard? I doubt it. Let's just act like Nothing's happening. We don't care. We're just sitting here reading a book. It's like nothing. We don't care. I could have been doing that instead instead of just breezing through this. Uh, should we try to attempt to not care again? With an hour? I mean, after this, there's no going back, right? Use. Yeah, that's a no. Oh, it, look, it broke. My thought was it was probably going to do it anyway. Got another hour. Do need some torches. Let's see what we're going to get. Yeah. A little better. Alright, how about if we move over just a little bit more? What have we now? Now a little worse. Okay, let's go over to the other side. Come on now. <laughs> worse. Okay, one last torch I'm gonna get out of this. That's not gonna stay lit, obviously. Yeah, pretty much just the same. Same old, same old. Boy, wouldn't it be nice if we could get to the cave with this? It looks like we may do just that. After I get a little something to drink before I uh, 
take a bunch of damage for nothing. How long have I been? Yeah, I probably should put my HUD on permanent. Well, I have lost a bit of condition, but nothing startling. So we're just going to carefully and methodically go on about our business, right? Now, if I have stalker wolves, <laughs> I barely made it down off of here last time on stalker, I'm telling you. Every which way I wanted to go was... Uh, Hazardous to my health. Oh, now come on. I'm just walking. The good thing is, is this cave will provide me with the needed uh, warmth. So we'll take it. And there's some goodies up in here, too. And some coal. Not that, uh... I will make it too far, but just in case, you know. Let's be prepared. I have five torches. Any coal? Not yet. Is this a dead end? No. Yes, it is. No, it isn't. So what is the other way? Have I... I have not been to this cave except maybe... four or five times. So maybe this is a loop. No matter. We're going to go with it. Oh, 100% torch. Is that great? Another one. Just in case I need some more knowledge, I have it right there. I don't think this cave has an abundance of coal, but it'll be enough for uh, my purposes at this point in the game. Burned out torch. All right. Well, what what happened there? I made a wrong turn somewhere. Ah, here we go. We're ascending. That's a good sign. Look at that torch. Wow. Beautiful torch. Now, of course, all this is fine and good till I step outside. And then it's a whole nother game. And I'm not fully warm. I think there's a fire somewhere. I mean, I'll make a fire one way or another. We will have to be fully warm to step out of this cave. Now, this must be a dead end. Yeah. Yes, it is. <coughs> well, I don't have... I don't think I have one stick on me. Ten minutes. We'll do it. I have another 100% torch. That didn't take too much life out of that. I need the sticks. Lovely. Now exactly... Like, is there a game plan? Can't, I, you know, I can't answer that. Right now, just getting to... You know what I really like? <laughs> 
<laughs> as much as the dead man's challenge is harsh, at least I get to go inside. I must say that that's a bonus. Outer loafer without a bedroll is just an exercise in futility. And you can make it, and you can make it a little bit, but until you get that bedroll, you're not really playing the game. You're just marginally staying ahead of death. But only by the slightest margin. Am I going back now? This this is this is a, another way, but I think I missed some stuff there. There goes my torch. Now why am I what whoa 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 Obviously I'm going back because I'm descending. No, I already came down, that's true. From Ah I inadvertently Now I'm confused. Won't be the first time. Or the last. Okay, so that's going back up. So obviously... I'm going the right way. I'll just be descending now. I'm not going to worry about it. Let it burn out. Now, what? what okay. Here it is. Luckily, it's 100% torch. Why does this split? Okay, this is the dead end. Rapid descent. No more coal, but I have found it quite a bit. Am I back where I, yes, I'm back where I came. How did I get back up that incline? <coughs> okay, am I totally lost here? In fact, I was supposed to, but I thought I came down that slope, not, if I came down that slope, okay, so I just made a wrong turn, let's see what it looks like, tell me this isn't where I came in. It is where I came in, okay, no matter. Just go back. It's still... Sun's still high in the sky. I'm just lost. I don't typically get lost in caves that much. But I am. Let's try this again. Sorry, folks. Forgive my lack of navigation skills. Let's try this again. I don't want to be in this cave either, but why am I getting cold? Why am I? <laughs> Come on, I got a torch, I'm in a cave. Give me a break. Uh, that'll be a no. No breaks. Just don't fire up another blizzard. Let me get out of here.
What am I missing here? Obviously, I am where I need to be. I need to go up the incline. There it is. Let's do this properly. Yeah, I'm just about to be freezing. Just about to be freezing. But I don't really think I have anything to do a fire with, to tell you the truth. Invalid location. Stick, one of three. Not good. That's true, there were no sticks. I'm going to get three sticks. I don't know. We'll see if I can warm up for 20 minutes. I get a little something on me. Obviously, oh, that's true, I got the coal. Ha, 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 ha. This is going to be just fine. I just have to make this fire last long enough. You know, put it away. Add some fuel. I'll burn one of those books if I have to. Yee, I don't know. I think if I have two more torches, it's enough. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. Fifteen minutes. Sixteen minutes. Oh, man. Oh, I'm warming up. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate you. Nineteen minutes. Well, I, I really don't care now because I'm warming up. That's all I was really concerned with. All in all, not too bad. I still have plenty enough daylight to get out of here and get down to the uh, the camp. Let me go ahead and do that. Other torch. Okay. Three arrows up. That's what I want to see. Here, I forgot. I got all that... Uh, all that good coal. Completely. <laughs> that's, that's my pessimism. You have no way to warm up. Yeah, but the, uh, the rest part of it's not doing too good. I don't think really a torch is going to do me any good out there. To tell you the truth, whatever's going on out there, I'm just going to have to deal with it. Because the next step will be eating, drinking, and sleeping.
two arrows down. <clears throat> Alright, this will just be luck. Complete and utter luck at this point. Because there are predators all over the place here. This is just going to take some... Uh, I can't get up here. I know you're out there. I'm going to take the high road. I don't really know what else to do here. And uh, it's all just going south. It's all bad. Yeah, the little sprain problem is uh, going to be an issue. <laughs> this may get ugly. But I really just don't have a choice. And I can't really spend too, too much time worrying about it. I will have to resort to crawling down here, though. A wabbit! Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, I'm in kind of dire straits at this point. Because there's the wolf. Hmm. I have no choice here. There's not much I can do. Too far? Ah! Oh, he saw me. <laughs> yeah, I know. Ah, uh, don't run down here. Go run somewhere else. You can't get me. Don't, don't, don't start with all that. Now your friends up here. <clears throat> I don't know about them, but you're out of the picture. Oh, I'm dying. I'm dying. With relief in sight, no doubt, but not because you know those wolves are right there. <coughs> I would attempt to go around. 
I don't think it's gonna happen. If these wolves aren't here, now there's one. There's no way to go around over that way either. It's just not. Is that two of them right there? Guys, come on now. Well, this is about all I can do. Um, I don't think they can get me up here. There was probably a quicker way to do this. To get down, but I don't know. I'm sure there are places that are climbable that are a more direct route. I'm just now getting frostbite risk. I would have thought that I just now got frostbite. Been more. So what are you guys going to do? I mean, I expected you to turn around. Thank you. Oh, don't do that. Um, Y'all are kind of making this unnecessarily difficult for me. Oh, good. No, I don't have painkillers, and I don't have bandage. And I can't run. And did you not hear that? Yeah, you did. Good. I, yeah, I was about to say, I, I don't recall throwing the rock in my direction. Hmm. Is this the spot I can't get up? I don't know if I can pull this off. But we're going to try. Hmm. Alright, I'm just going to have to try to sneak around this. Oh, I'm just going so slow. Yeah, the sprains were just, uh, I mean, I'll, I went through all that. Then I get a sprain right here where I need to be able to get up. That's all right. I will get there. I'm not dead by any stretch. I don't know if I want to get up and walk yet. Let's hobble over. Three hundred calories. I may need it. I don't know. And the tinder. Now this may get the wolves coming after me. I don't know. This may be a death sentence right here. I mean, 
The detection range isn't far, which I thought was a little strange for the settings, since the settings are supposed to be at max. It's at, like, medium. No, I mean at, uh, yeah, it's at, like, medium. Yeah, I have nothing for firewood in there. I mean, not really. Enough to make you feel like you're going to be fine. All right. If nothing else, it's a dead man's challenge, and I got this far, so I'm not going to complain about that. Optional. I have not. No, I thought I did. I think I used it. All right, let's get some warmth happening. And get an hour of sleep. And get stabilized. Put the torch away. Not yet. How about now? All right. A little food. Just out of curiosity, a vest. Maglins, that would be a no. Cool. Not a typical find in there. And what do we have? Nothing, nothing on the bench, nothing, ah, a hammer, a hammer, let's put the, uh, let's put that vest on, and let's sleep an hour. Hour and twenty. Three. Okay. What else have we got for ailments? Pain. Hour and 42 minutes, spring, two hours, four hours. <clears throat> well, we're going to sleep all this off, get a little healthier. Well, not healthier, but you know what I mean, in better condition with our stats over there. We're going to get some birch bark. like an unlimited uh, bits of stem all over the world, right? So that's our situation. We have cattails out there. We have wolves out there. Take a look in the fishing hut, see if we have our headgear. May or may not be there. Get our cattails, but hey, we made it. We made it to the Mountaineer's cabin. <clears throat> we are safe for the moment, and we have birch bar tea in the, to make, to find and make, right? No mag lens, no ski jacket. What would that have been a find? That would have set me up very nicely, but, you know, hey, 
it is what it is, right? So we're going to get ourselves fixed up a little better. And when we come back, <clears throat> hmm, I don't know. I haven't decided whether we're going to, I don't have a hacksaw, so I would go over to the shipping, to, to the, to the containers over by the wing piece, but you know, it's just not going to happen. So we'll probably be getting out of here, but I'll, I'll gather up what I can because there's rose hips. There's, uh, there's some rabbits over there. You know, we'll see. So when I come back, we'll, uh, I'll have a more clear-cut plan on what I have intended. Probably just go to Pleasant Valley and we'll move on from there and see what happens. So, anyway, this is my Dead Man's Challenge beginning. And thanks for watching. And I'll see you back here next time.